Belgorod right now. Thanks to Putin for the special military operation. Russian telegram channels shared more details about the Russian aircraft that crashed yesterday in Crimea. Reportedly, it was a Su-27, and it was shot down by the Russian Pantsir anti-aircraft missile gun system. For some unknown reason, the air defense did not receive notification of the departure of their Su-27. Because the Pantsir system's combat crew did not receive a response from the Su-27 pilot to its interrogation, a decision was made to fire the plane for effect. As it became known later, the system's crew interrogation did not reach the Su-27 pilot because the IFF interrogator on the Pantsir system was not working correctly. Some Russian media called this a technical deficiency. Marines of the Ukrainian 36th Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine used the Stugna P ATGM remotely located in the body of a pickup truck on a Russian armored personnel carrier. How to lit tanks with grenades. You can see the rather desperate improvised armor of one of the Russian tanks. all eliminated in a minute after the picture was taken. On the 21st of March, 2024, outskirts of the village of Berdichi, Donetsk region. Oof, a Russian 9S-36 target acquisition radar, which is a vital element for the BUK air defense system, destroyed by an FPV drone. This is what called value for money. Russian MP and murderer of Alexander Litvinenko calls for what is called genocide in the world practice. MP Lugovoy demanded a humanitarian catastrophe in Kharkiv to make the city deserted. And again, life in Belgorod, now thanks to Putin. Zelensky had a telephone conversation with the Speaker of the U.S. House of Representatives, Mike Johnson. The President told the Speaker about the situation on the battlefield, in particular about the rapid increase in Russian air terror. 
In the past week alone, Ukrainian cities and communities were hit by 190 rockets, 140 Shahid drones, and 700 anti-aircraft missiles. The largest Ukrainian hydroelectric power plant has been disabled. In this situation, the rapid approval of aid to Ukraine by Congress is critically important. We realize that the House of Representatives has different positions on how to do it, but the main thing is that the issue of aid to Ukraine remains a unifying factor, Zelensky added. Russian propagandist Skabayeva complains that Western media has neglected the terrorist attack in Russian Crocus City Hall. The writing on shells in the video says, to Paris. Ukraine is building more fortifications in the Zaporizhia direction. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, if you want to support Warthog Defense, please become our member and get early access to new videos, exclusive members only videos, and become administrator in comment section. The membership link is in the description. Rescues. Every day we had a guy last week at six rescues in six days. You know, he's doing the job every day.